Hey there, everybody. World 4 is in the books, and we're on to Stage 5. I'm around the wheel. Welcome back to Bugs Bunny Birthday Blowjob. And this is actually probably... Not to be unfair to this world, but it's probably the most forgettable level in the game. I mean, it's nice and everything, but it's just kind of... I would say, there. I mean, it's just kind of a world between 4 and 6 that kind of... It lightens the mood before World 6 gets all moody and noir -y and stuff. Can you break these? You cannot. They are pretty sturdy-looking Mondrian blocks there. Oh, hey, you guy. Okay, and then disappear and grab the rope. It's not as hard as the Angry Gamer made it out to be. Angry Video Game Nerd. I'm getting my angries and my irates mixed up, which is horrible because that's completely unfair to the Angry Video Game Nerd. Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you think you're doing, Bugs? Yeah, this is an okay level, but it's really nothing special. Although, I like these really... I like these pink walls. You would think they'd be pretty silly looking, especially, you know, that whole 90s aesthetic, day-glow colors, day-glow palette, pastels and stuff. But actually, it works out pretty well, because this is a pretty, pretty hot pink, and I don't mean a mess either. Alright, come my way, rope. And you have to, uh, you have to... Oh, I thought you had to hold up to hang on to the rope. I thought it was that kind of rope. Some ropes in video games are quite slippery, but this one I've apparently always somehow misinformed myself about. This... Ah, all right, that had the potential to be incredibly stupid, like most things I do. Oh, God! Good thing he was green. Green means go, red means stop. Even my five-year-old knows that. All right, nobody... Okay. Nobody's coming to get me, and I'm not going to get anybody else. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Thank you. This is quite the harrowing tree climb, actually. Bugs has got himself quite a set of tree climbers. Whoa, 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 whoa. I thought I jumped on you, and it turns out I didn't, so now I'm panicking. There we go. Run into the wall, and I'm just going to... Okay, yes, this is actually worth doing, because I'll actually get somehow six chances to play... The bonus game. I can't believe I'm hanging on to this thing. And you can barely tell that you're supposed to go into that thing. In fact, if it weren't at the end of the level, I wouldn't even know that I had to go in there. Oh, so I gotta get on your level, do I, Daffy? When are you gonna... When are you gonna come to me? Yeah! Okay. Yeah, we got six good chances for lives here, so... Don't blow it, you stupid rabbit. I'm gonna cut off your foot for some good luck. Here we go. It's not working. Here's your foot back. I'll stitch that on for you later. Oh, that was so close to being a thing. Although it kind of looks like an arrow if you really think about it. I thought for a second I had 72 carrots, but no. I have 72 lives, and I'm blowing all my good chances here. I guess the more carrots you get, the shittier it decides to treat you. Yes, thank you. One life. Woo, okay. You are not helping me get to 99. That's the ultimate goal of the game. I have to make up goals for this game because the normal goal has just become too boring and passe. And now we are going up into the clouds. Don't turn red yet. I have things to do around here. Oh, hey, that's probably not the best route then. Sure, we'll just... Let's just... Okay, you're not going to make this easy, are you, game? You're going to make me take at least one hit... Wow, that's actually kind of a difficult jump to make, if I even can. There we go. Was a little worried about my chance there. Jump off. Jump off the edge, Mr. Ronald McDonald Hammer. I dare you. Now we are getting to the ledges that blink in and out on their own. This must have been... These must have been the ones that the that got Mr. Mr. Angry Guy all tied up in a kerfuffle. Shit. Nope. All right, yeah. As long as we stay... As long as we stay high up and avoid explosions and traffic tickets, we ought to be fine. I'm going to get a little risky here. Get a little risque. Going to put on my risky boots. And, oh, that probably just ever reminded everybody. Oh, hey, yes, powerful hammer. Does that, how is that helpful at all? Okay. Well, I came down here tempted by hell, so I guess, I guess I have cast my lot in life. Let's try... You just decided you had nothing to live for, you silly little hammer man. Oh, gosh. Hammer, don't hurt him. Come on now. But, yeah, I probably just reminded everybody that I haven't done Shantae in forever, so that was really smart. Way to go, Jess. Now, what is the difference between... Okay, let's test it on the frog guy here. 
Uh, let's let him... Eh. Okay, it does make you give you a more powerful hammer, so that is helpful. I was struggling for a second to... I was struggling for a second to see what was actually the difference between the... Oh, hey. The difference between the speed power up and the... Hey, who threw away a perfectly good clock? And moreover, why are you trying to palm it off on me? That is... That is a cheap move there. Let's see if we can uh, at least get enough... Oh, wow. These blink in and out pretty frequently, actually. This was probably not advisable, but okay. I still... Managed it, and I think we can get in a good five licks before. Yeah, all right. Oh, well, this is a weirdly unnecessary room. Speaking of things that are weird, that is a that spider is crazy creepy. Can I kill it? I cannot kill it. Not even with a souped-up hammer. Not even with a mouth that I bought from Ace Hardware. Whoa, man. Looks like some looks like some rabbit hunter grew some big balls. Oh well, maybe not. He he decided to get off that first shot, but no, not having it. Let's get out of here. This level is going to pass by quickly and without incident. Let's go. Bonus round. Hopefully, a little more luck this time. I'm gonna cut off both your feet if you don't start giving me some luck bugs. It's your ass on the line here. You got it. You stupid rabbit. All right, I'm drawing some low numbers here. How about the... Let's be high rollers. Okay, maybe not. Oh, this is dismal. Well, one right down the middle. That's always nice. What more can you really ask for? Well, there's plenty more I could ask for, but... There we go. That's a little more in line with what I'm expecting here. Let's... We'll see you later. Yes, indeed. It won't be too much later. Only a few minutes from now. These levels pass by fairly quickly if you know what you're doing. Oh, God, yes, and I continue to extol the praises of the platform shield. All right, that was a bit risky, but worth it. You can barely see the... You can barely see the ropes against the trees there. That's a bit of a pallet goof, I would say. Oh, hey. Uh, yeah, sure, let's, let's go with a mallet that I'm going to lose extremely quickly, I'm sure. This looks like a very busy level. Yeah, that was just me being a stupid idiot. Yeah, let's get rid of the frog. We don't want him stepping up into our game. I can see the rope a lot better from right here. Now, as I recall, it's kind of hard to get these ropes to join up, but if I jump now... Oh, yeah, we got some we got some kind of ropey rubbish going on here, some Donkey Kong Country. Trying to horn in on that Donkey Kong Country dime, weren't you, Bugs? Four years before that game even came out. I like how they leave a little... Now, I got distracted by the background pattern that the... That the thing leaves. It's nice and a uh, nice and a uh, kind of kind of whoa patchworky. Hey, where are you carrying me off to? This ain't Super Mario Land, dude. I don't need a ride over the spikes. Yeah, just stay out of my life. Rogue clocks. I'll just check the time on my phone if you're gonna treat me this way. Who even really carries a wristwatch anymore or some kind of? Oh, we're going up. That seemed to suggest some downward. That was quite a jump to have to make there, actually. Okay, I'm going to jump from way out. Come here. From downtown! Puts up a brick! Oh, God. Yeah, those probably aren't worth it unless I discover that I can jump from out here. Yeah, there's the layup. More basketball imagery. I can not kill the trash can, which makes sense. That thing is durable and meant only for yard work use. Okay. Let's 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 fall into a pit. That's cool. Let's let's pretend that the jump button isn't even a thing. That's fine by me. All right, let's try that again. Although it started me out with I don't think it takes away your carrots when you die, so Probably going to have more chances than normal to score some pretty more than decent one-uppage. Although, knowing my luck, I'm not about to hold my breath or get too excited. And if you think I'm going down there, y you are... That was my controller's fault that time. Okay, yes, I blamed my controller, and that's an incredibly cheap thing to do. But I think the word mashy has come up before in my problems with this thing. I think it might be about time to replace this controller that I'm using, because it's had... More and more issues with moving me involuntarily forward when I don't want it to. So rest assured that it might be cheap to blame my controller for my platforming woes, but 
Not without good reason here. And I think I figured out the carrot thing. I think it takes away half your carrots when you die. So, so it kind of works out that you have more chances to score one-ups at the end. Well, what have we got? I don't think we want to get the carrot just yet. I think we want to jump over Daffy. Yes, it's also carrot season. Yum, yum, yum. Oh my god. This is a lot of lottery playing we've got coming for us. We've got nine chances to rectify the mistakes of the past. I already like where this is going. If I can just get a one-up every time, that'll be nine lives. And I think I'm well on my way to recovering the two that I lost right there in that one little slot. Okay. Very excellent. I'm already digging the direction we're taking. Maybe I should try dying more often. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm, I'm feeling confident now. I feel like we're we're definitely going to hit the 99 mark, especially with Willy Weasel and his ilk coming up. Oh, that's a cruel little arrangement right there. I don't dig on that so much. No, so it's actually probably to your advantage to uh, die on purpose a time or two. If you want to... If you want to really rack up the chances in the bingo game here, man, this is going pretty all right. Moral of the story, bring a lot of money to the casino and you are bound to win at least a few times. <laughs> well, that is certainly a pleasure, but we still have not caught the mythical Captain Sherman, the five in a row. Where be ye? Aw, oh, that, that was close to another five up, man. I'm I'm feeling the rush of the slots. I'm feeling I'm feeling a winner's rush here. They're gonna have to call the cooler to come in and kick me out of the casino to put me down. Hello, Castle Pink. You are having a frog infestation. I believe this was presaged by the Book of Exodus. Where ah ha ha! But if I can make your frog security guards do stupid things, then it's all good. How did I fall there? I thought I had. Thought I had gotten that pattern down pretty well. Yes. Yes, I evaded all of your st stupid frog guards. Oh, yeah, I didn't quite mean to do that, but okay, I'll take it. Now, what happens if I go down back to this ledge here? Will it go down or no? I gotta take the actual exit. Falling rocks from the sky. You know, you people have a problem. I think you live too close to the World 3 volcano. Okay, falling clocks, dude. Falling rocks, falling clocks, falling things that rhyme with awk. Uh, my mind just went to the bad place. Okay, I should have used that as a platform, now that I think about it. Now, will he open up and... Man, I really want some carrots, actually. I'm having a craving for carrots like never before, and I think I might have blown my chance by not jumping from the... Oh, no, you can always go back and retry. Well, that's pretty excellent. Okay... Okay, you can't run across single space gaps like Mario can. I have met Mario, and Bugs Bunny, you, sir, are no Mario. Here we go. Make the leap. You ought to be able to make the leap. You're a rabbit, after all. Well, you're a rabbit who doesn't star in Crazy Castle, although actually you are. I guess Bugs just jumps when he feels like it. He seems like a very capricious little rabbit man. No, 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 no. Okay, I was going to say, don't take me up to the boss, who's probably somehow situated in the sky, without letting me go down and get that health freebie. And I'm remembering the boss now. I think it's Foghorn Leghorn, who is the boss of this particular world. He's big and he's mean. Oh, yeah, you got to get up top and uh, hit Mr. Chicken Man somehow, or Mr. Chicken Hawk over here. Henry Hawk, who I always thought was really weird how his name was spelled Henry and not Henry. Now, I don't think you're invincible. You're just really slow and you don't actually attack in any meaningful way. You just take a lot of hits, that's all. Okay, are you Mr. Indestructo Man? Did I make a mistake here? You are taking a ton of hits. I think you're actually supposed to hit the dude. Can I stand on your head? That's the only way I can foresee getting up here. Yes, I can. Okay. Should have kind of guessed that, but I let a stupid little chicken hawk get the best of me. Well, once you figure out the pattern, they both go down like a sack of rocks. And that's that. Aw, you made the carrot appear over there so I wouldn't get the big ups. It's like the wand in Mario 3. You have to get the big ups for it to mean anything. Can we achieve 99 here? If not, we surely will by the end of the game, which was kind of the goal I had in mind the whole time anyway. Let's roll. Yes. 
Reliable top middle slot as ever. Yeah, I don't want to get too caught up in other slots here. You want to stay in a small radius. I like how I can somehow do multiple hammer hits. Yeah, four lives that time. Can we make it five? This is where the magic happens. Let's do it. You were actually a little fast that time, top middle one. Oh, I'm feeling the burn. I'm feeling the fire. Alright, yes. We didn't start the fire. It's always been burning since Bugs Bunny's loins were burning, turning. Oh! Damn! <laughs> Shit. Well, we're bound to score at least one life in the next three levels. So, join us next time for the finale of Bugs Bunny Birthday Blowout. That's going to do it for us today. We will see you next time in a very low-key museum-type world, which is a lot of fun and a great way to cap off the game. So, see you guys next time.